So guys, I did a fantasy draft. I wasn't able to get it on video, and because I had it on video, but I accidentally shut the, my thing ran out of battery. So kind of, I accidentally shut it off. So it could be said that, but you know, whatever. So <clears throat> I drafted a lot of guys. And I'll show you my whole entire depth chart, and uh, hope you guys enjoy this video. So we're taking off with the Vikings, and uh, <clears throat> so this is week one. We're just gonna hopefully we can get through this week. I'm gonna show you guys our depth chart and. Uh, Hopefully this game goes well and we can finally win it and we won't end up tying. So we're gonna Vikings are gonna receive it. We're doing one minute quarters. As usual. I think they have Tony Romo. But uh show she I'll uh, show you guys our uh our roster. Currently we have a quarterback, Mike Glennon, Kirk Cousins, and Kellen Moore, along with Thomas Savage as our as on our practice squad. Sam Martin and Matt Prater. And so at halfback, we got Shady, Jonathan Stewart, and Andrew Hale, along with Devontae Freeman. And, uh, so yeah, this video is going to be a good one. We got very Fitzgerald, Roker, Tate, Moncrief, and Hale could go there at number six. Okay, guys, so let's get into this game. Let's have a good game. So we're going to kick off with the four, so... First one to score <clears throat> has a good shot of winning, so let's hope we can have some good defense today. As Prater's going to kick this one off. Matt Prater. Uh, no! So, guys, this is iDog. And if you guys are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button and like this channel. Game error. Jeez, I didn't. <laughs> we'll be right back. So guys, this has turned into a really weird <clears throat> video, but I decided to do this video and turn it into a what if video. So you guys got to see one play of that, and it's called "What If the um, Colts Never Release Peyton Manning." Now, as you guys know, Peyton Manning got replaced technically by Andrew Luck. Well, we're thinking, what if? Did get replaced by Andrew Luck, and that's what the, the topic of this iDog is going to be. What if video is going to be? So we're talking about right now. What if Peyton Manning didn't get it? So I, I don't have anything to check who the draft pieces was, but uh, so the 2012 draft we all know was really stacked. Okay, um, RG3 went second pick to the Redskins. So that doesn't change anything, but what if, <clears throat> what if they hadn't done anything? So the uh, Indianapolis Colts ended up saying, okay, we like Peyton Manning, let's just keep him on the roster. And so they keep him on the roster, and then they say, oh, I'm going to do this. And they go, and really, it's kind of a dumb decision, but they say, you know, we're just going to stay with Peyton Manning. And... It's kind of a dumb decision, it's kind of not, but, you know, this guy's trusting him, even though he's getting up in his old age. So, they don't actually get him. So, but you know who does. Broncos are looking for a quarterback to replace Timothy Tebow. Now, Timothy Tebow is one of my favorite quarterbacks in the whole entire thing. Uh, as you know, I have a poster of him in my bedroom, <clears throat> along with Jimmy G, <clears throat> and... You know, it's, he's just one of my favorite players, but there was a time in the Broncos just wanted to get rid of him. So, the Bronx get rid of him. Okay, they say, you know, they and they draft Andrew Ruck. So, 2012 is kind of getting weird right now. <clears throat> so, they just release him. So, they don't trade into the Jets. They just release him. And then, uh, guess who ends up getting... Peyton Manning stays with the coat. So, then, Tim Tebow, our third guy of this What If video, ends up going to the Jaguars. So, at this time, in 2012, the Jaguars are, like, not so good. They have Chad Heen, and maybe that's it. So, they don't have Blake Bors yet, <clears throat> and so they're like... You know, 
let's just get a new quarterback and Tim Tebow is this the person in the video. Now this isn't a copy off of KTO's what if video. No, I just saw Jacksonville Jaguars. This is no way a copy of his video. He's an awesome YouTuber. And I'll get a link in the description for you guys. Anyways, <clears throat> so he still is there. And so 2012 season is a good season for the Colts. They keep with Toby, I mean, they keep with uh, Peyton Manning, and he ends up <clears throat> going, and he ends up going really good, and he ends up throwing, like, really good. <clears throat> so they end up going 12 and 4. So it's a good season for the Colts, make the playoffs. They go to the conference battle, lose to the New England Patriots in the conference battle. <clears throat> <clears throat> Jacksonville Jaguars and Timothy Tebow. They have an okay season, better than they probably want to, but <clears throat> they go 8-8 eight and eight and miss the playoffs, excuse me. And so they're like, okay, so we missed the playoffs. And so they're like, do we really want to stay with Tim Tebow? So they, they're kind of all messed up, you know. <clears throat> so they go with Tim Tebow. They say, okay, we can have Tim Tebow. And I like... <clears throat> and so then the uh, Andrew Luck and the Broncos throw for a good game. I mean, they have a good season, but <clears throat> really, <clears throat> in the end, they don't make the playoffs. They end up going 8-8, eight and eight, just like the Jaguars. 2013, not really anything changes. Wasn't well, really anybody that changes, except that the Broncos end up going this season and they're having a good season with Andrew Luck and go 9-7. and seven, Make the wild card, but lose to divisional rivals, <clears throat> rivals the uh, Kansas City Chiefs. So then the Colts have another good season, kind of. They end up going 10-6. and six, Make the wild card, win, their, win the division, and end up being the Tennessee Titans in the conference battle to go to the Super Bowl to face off with <clears throat> the... Uh, who was that going to... Oh, yes. There was... I mean, the St. Louis Rams. They save off the St. Louis Rams in the Super Bowl, and they win the Super Bowl with Peyton Manning. And, uh, obviously, Jacksonville has another 8-8 eight eight season, and they're fed up with Timothy Tebow, and they end up saying, okay, guess what? You're going to be released. They draft Blake Borders. So, Tim Tebow gets released. He says, you know, do I really want to play football anymore? Do I really want to? He goes... To the Tennessee Titans to be a backup there. So, 2014, the Indianapolis Colts have another good season, kind of. They go 9 and 7, lose in the divisional after they won the wild card. Broncos don't have a very good season, they end up going 7 and 9. Timothy Tebow doesn't get much playing time for the Titans, they end up going 8 and 8, so they miss the playoffs, anyways. So 2014 was an okay year for the Colts, not for really any of those other two teams. Timothy Tebow is released by the Tennessee Titans and goes to the CFL, to the um, BC Lions. I don't know if I got that team right. I'm not a CFL follower. He goes to the C he goes to the CFL to the BC Lions. Okay. Uh, David Carr did in our first What If video. So he does that and. <clears throat> You know, he's he does okay, really, in the CFL, but they they lose the Grey Cup and uh, to Hamilton, and they lose that. And so, <clears throat> Tim Tebow stays in the CFL, and the, the Indianapolis has their first losing season as they end up going 5-11. and 11. Broncos have a come-out-of-the-water season, 13 to uh thirteen to thirteen thirteen and three sorry thirteen and three <clears throat> is their record and you know thirteen and three ends up being their record and so they go all the way to the conference battle but lose to the New England Patriots 